this is not your finish line. We expect you to go on and do great things. We expect you to always live those gaucho qualities, competitive, driven, caring, giving, and significant. It's been six years now that I've been in the States, you know, two years of high school and four years of uh, college now at UCSB, and uh, it's kind of just a dream come true right now, you know. So it's definitely a huge thing, thing for me to have that degree. Being a gaucho for me isn't just being an athlete, it's being a supportive member of the community, the gaucho community. Because I was so dedicated to track, it, it made me want to strive to do more in my academics and um, just like be competitive in everything that I do and just be a better person overall. In order to be the best, like I always say, you have to outwork the best. And that's exactly what we've accomplished uh, this year. I think most of you, when you came here four or maybe five years ago, there were probably 40,000 applicants for the, for the freshman class at that point in time uh, for about the same number of slots as we have uh, today. And it was hard to get into at that point in time. Uh, this year, we've had 55,000 applications for the same number of slots. So the incoming average GPA for our freshman class in fall of 2012 is about 4.0. And so that's just a marvelous uh, accomplishment for students to get into UC Santa Barbara anymore. You should be proud of yourselves that you've not only gotten in, uh, that you're getting a degree here. 500 universities around the world impact on science and social science. UC Santa Barbara came in seventh in the world. Number seven. The top six were all private universities. So we, we represent the top public research university in the world in terms of its impact on science and social science. And you should be very proud of being a member of UC Santa Barbara.